I trust you had an amazing week. Have you been standing strong in God's image? Have you ensured that God's word, values, and standard has been influencing all you do? And have you been sharing them with your friends and family? Good. Keep standing strong. Remember, whatever God wouldn't do, you shouldn't do. Say after me again. Whatever God wouldn't do, you shouldn't do. Can you say that louder? Yes, whatever God wouldn't do, you shouldn't do. How many pieces of God's armor have you learned so far? Correct! Three. Now, let's identify them together. Number one, the belt of truth. Number two, breastplate of righteousness. And number three, the shoes of peace. We refresh our memory on how each of these armor helps us to stand strong during our praise break last week. And we had an awesome experience, right? My boys and girls on fire, I need you to make up your mind to stand strong at all times. What did I say? You stand strong at all times, no matter what happens. You have to stand strong because you are the best and you always make God proud. Come on, my boys and girls on fire, let's declare together. Are we ready? I want you on your feet now as we declare together. I am a boy on fire. I am a girl on fire. I am royalty. I belong to the best king. Anytime, any day, no matter what happens, I stand strong in God's image. I've got the power. Nothing can stop me from being amazing like Jesus. I have the full armor of God on at all times. Great job, guys. Can we say that again? Can we say it again? I am a boy on fire. I am a girl on fire. I am royalty. I belong to the best king. Anytime, any day, no matter what happens, I stand strong in God's image. I've got the power. Nothing can stop me from being amazing like Jesus. I have the full armor of God on at all times. Great, guys. Today, we're going to learn the fourth piece of the armor of God. It's about time, right? We're going to have a splendid time together. All right? All right? So first, I want you to put on your dancing shoes as we praise God together. Remember, what God wouldn't do, you shouldn't do. So you need to be obedient. I need you to pick up your dancing shoes now and let's praise God together. Oh yes, get on your feet, my boys and girls on fire, and let's praise God together.
Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for that is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for that is with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup runs over. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Our uncle scripture, Isaiah 54 verse 13, I, Angela Jaja, shall be taught of the Lord, and grace shall be my peace. Hallelujah. I am. I am confident. I am wise. I am successful. I am blessed. I am healthy. I am wealthy. I am knowledgeable. I am influential. I understand. I am intelligent. I am above and never beneath. I am a boy of fire. I am a girl of fire. I love burning with all my heart. My passion for you is everywhere at all times. You two keep you two safe. You know the girl by the summer. You also be careful of pleasing to God and to people. This is my testimony. This is my experience. The world is a great and blessed. You know that the fear of God. Everyone understands it. I eat what the doctor has to say. I am content and the doctor always. I am a child and a wonder. I am a snapper. Every day is better than me in magic. I am a self. I am a high flyer. Always a fire for God. on fire I need you to pay attention I have something very interesting to show you how do I maneuver this now I can't even see and I need to see it how do I get through I can't do this I will do this Listen to that voice because I don't trust it. I'll do this myself. I don't know what to do now. But I need help finding my way to my seat. I have to get through no matter what. I can do this. I am not giving up. That seat is mine. I trust God to help me all the way. So come forward. Come forward. Come forward. Come step forward. I know I am not perfect. I make mistakes, but I trust God to lead and help me. I will listen to His voice. One step forward to your left, another step to your left, then 
right about turn one step backward then you can sit down yes i did it i'm so happy i did it my trust in god paid off i listened and obeyed i did it yes How did I even get through all this? Even when I tripped, I still got up. I did it. This is amazing. God can be trusted. Yay! Yay! <laughs> wow, that was so interesting, right? I'd like you to tell me a few things you learned. No, wait, let me tell you what I learned. If you choose not to trust and obey God, you will get frustrated and fail. And you might even want to give up on your dreams. But oh no, no, no. We can't let that happen now, can we? No, because we are all counting on you. God is counting on you and he wants to help you. God is always speaking with you. Even when you are passing through those frustrating moments, and it looks like there are obstacles on the way, God is right there. He can be trusted. All you have to do is listen to him, follow his instructions, obey him, because God can be trusted. Yes, he can be trusted. He is all powerful and he's willing to help you achieve all your dreams so that you can stand strong in his image. But you have to trust and obey him. Yeah, trust and obey. I believe by now, you know that part of the armor we are talking about. Yes, it's the shield of faith. I want you to know that even though you do not see God or understand how things are going to work out, you can trust him completely. He sees you and he wants to help you achieve your dreams. And your faith in him can help you stand strong against Satan's fiery death. You might want to ask me, what are the fiery darts? Now, Satan, in his sneaky self, tries to get into our thoughts and distracts us and makes us think God cannot be trusted. But we all know that's a lie because God can be trusted and he sees everything and he wants to help you every step of the way. So can you say this after me? God can be trusted. Let's say it again. God can be trusted. Yes, good job everyone. Now I want you to always remember to put on your shield of faith at all times, okay? Now sit back, relax, and let's take the memory verse. Soldiers for Christ, stand at attention. Yes, sir. Soldiers for Christ, stand at attention. Yes, sir. Now, let's recite our memory verse together using our hand motion. Are you ready? Are you ready? My boys and girls on fire. Let's go. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 11. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 11. Put on all of God's armor, then you can remain strong against the devil's evil plans. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 11. Put on all of God's armor, then you can remain strong against the devil's evil plans. Fantastic! Can you say your memory verse all by yourself now, without my help? Can you? Okay, now we're going to do something. I'm just going to demonstrate and then you say it. Right? Are you ready? Let's go. That was fun, right? So let's try it one more time. This time around, you have to say it out loud to everyone. Right? Let's go. Now, 
Can we say it out loud together again? Are you ready? Don't forget our hand motions. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 11. Put on all of God's armor, then you can remain strong against the devil's evil plans. Can we do it one last time? Ephesians chapter 6, verse 11. Put on all of God's armor, then you can remain strong against the devil's evil plan. Make sure you keep saying it to yourself all through the week, okay? Jump on your feet and let's march. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. 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 Left, Knowing we've got you inside us, Lord Jesus. Round our waist, the belt of truth. That we tell the truth all this day and have the truth in us. Our feet fitted with a readiness to spread the gospel of peace. The gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. In one hand, we have a sword, which is the word of God. And we thank you for your word, Lord. In the other hand, a shield of faith. With which we can fight off all the flaming arrows of the evil one. And we're ready to pray in the Spirit on all occasions. We thank you, Lord. We praise you. And out into the day we go. In Jesus' name, all God's soldiers said, Amen. Amen. Okay, soldiers, let's march. Oh, who's got their armor on? We've got our armor on. Oh, peace by peace, we'll put it on. Peace by peace, we'll put it on. Oh, who's got their armor on?
minute, guys. Just one minute. I need to catch my breath. Never, never ever go out without your armor. Never ever go out without your armor. All right. Whew. Now it's time to keep learning about the shield of faith. Today we'll be reading from Ephesians chapter 6, verse 10 to 16. Are you ready, guys? Do you have your Bible with you? I want you to open your Bibles as you read. I believe you are familiar with this scripture already. So let's go. One, two, go. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 10 to 16. Finally, be strong in the Lord and his mighty power. Put on the full armor of God, so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against authorities, against the powers of this dark world, and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Therefore, put on the full armor of God, so that when the day of evil comes, you may be able to stand your ground, and after you have done everything to stand, stand firm. Then, with the belt of truth buckled around your waist, with the breastplate of righteousness in place, and with your feet fitted with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace. In addition to all this, take up the shield of faith, with which you can extinguish all the flaming arrows of the evil one. My boys and girls on fire, we are still learning about the shield of faith. Can I ask you a question? What is faith? We have learned severally about faith in the past and we've been able to ascertain that faith is one of the major secrets of being boys and girls on fire. So please, tell me, remind me, what is faith? Did you say faith is the absolute trust in God by having a deep connection with Him? Correct! Faith is absolute trust in God by having a deep connection with Him. You trust Him to give you victory and success at all times. Who do you think had faith between Auntie Dereli and Auntie Mayowa while trying to navigate the obstacle course? You seem to understand this faith thing now. Yes, it was Auntie Mayowa. Auntie Mayowa listened to the voice and she followed instructions, even though she couldn't see. Now, what is a shield? Soldiers hold their shields to protect themselves from the arrow of the enemy. Now, these shields are not fixed. It can be moved wherever directions these arrows are coming from. So once it touches the shield, it falls and it becomes powerless. This exactly is how the shield of faith works. So no matter what angle the attacks are coming from, once you focus on pleasing God, dwelling on his word, you stand strong. The devil's fiery arrows cannot touch you because once he hits your shield of faith, it becomes powerless and it is quenched. So with God's help, you can push on, overcoming all obstacles. You can achieve and supersede all of your goals. With this, you have great success at all times. God can be trusted. Never let anything take this truth away from you. So say this with me. I am a boy on fire. I am a girl on fire. I am royalty. I belong to the best king. Anytime, any day, no matter what happens, I stand strong in God's image. Nothing can stop me from being amazing like Jesus. I have the full armor of God on at all times. Did you get that? Can we take it again? Good. I am a boy on fire. I am a girl on fire. I am royalty. I belong to the best king. Anytime, any day, no matter what happens, I stand strong in God's image. I've got the power. Nothing can stop me from being amazing like Jesus. I have the full armor of God on at all times. Yes, you do. 
Now, let's do a big tree dance together. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Put on your armor guy. Put on your armor guy. Put on your armor guy. You got your armor guy. Got, got my belt of truth check. Breast plate of righteousness. Shoes of peace. Shield of hate. Helmet of salvation. Sword of the spirit. Helmet of salvation. talking about the shoes of faith. Let me see you do something right with me. Stretch your hand forward. What is this? That's the shield of faith. Yes, to protect you from the fiery arrows of the devil. And what are those fiery arrows? They are those things that the devil uses at different times to distract us, to take us away from the presence of God. Yes, uh, let me explain further. Don't be confused. Now listen. The same arrows, we would describe them with five Ds. Five what? Five Ds. Yes, five Ds. Five Ds. Five Ds are those fiery arrows that the devil uses to distract us, to take us away from the presence of God. Okay, good. Listen, stretch your hand. I used to hold your shield of faith. Stretch your hand, hold it, yes, and raise it up. Yes. Keep holding the shield, the shield of faith. Do not be distracted. Now the first D, the first D we are talking about is discouragement. Uh, discouragement. Hmm. You know questions like, does God really love me? Quench it. Yes, silence our thoughts. Quench it. Do not let it come close to you. Hmm. Am I good enough? Quench it. Oh, yes, very good. Good job. Good job, you are doing good. Now keep the shield up, all right? We're going to the second D, which is what? Doing wrong. Hmm. Doing wrong? Quench it! 
Pass. Good. Great job. Remember, hold your shoulder. Yes. And say with me, I will always do the right thing. Yes. Say it again. I will always do the right thing. Shoulder fit. Good. Good job. Great job. Now we are going to the third D. Remember, keep your shoulder. Keep your shield up. Those things, those fiery arrows must not come close to us. Number three. Yes, the third D. Yes, keep your shield up. Yes, you. Don't look back. Keep it up. Yes, the third D is doubt. Mm, doubt. Crush it. Shield of faith. Keep your shield up. Yes, do not doubt that God loves you. God loves you at all times. God can be trusted. Yes, God can be trusted. I am so, so excited. This is exciting. We are pointing all the fiery arrows of the devil together. Clap for yourself. Clap for yourself. You're doing a good job. Yes, remember, keep your shields up. Right? Keep it up. The fourth D is deception. Yes, quench every lies of the devil. Quench it. Good job. Good job. Quench it. Only God's word can be true. Only God's word is true. His word says, you are healed. Say it. I believe it. Shield of faith. That will protect you from all the lies of the devil. Yes. Yes. Quench that arrow of sickness. I believe it. His word says, you are above always and never been it. Remember, so you cannot fail. Tell yourself, shield up. I cannot fail because the Lord is on my side. Remember, now, we are standing strong and quenching all these fiery arrows of the devil. Now, the fifth D, the fifth D is destruction. Hmm. Destruction, yeah. Shield of faith. It will protect you at all times. With your shield of faith in place, you will always stand strong and you are always safe in God. Awesome, boys and girls of fire. Awesome, awesome. Clap yourself. Yes. Keep holding up the shield of faith. And to quench all these deeds, all the deeds we've talked about, remember, discouragement, shield of faith, doing wrong, doubt, hmm, good boy, deception, good girl, and what? Destruction. In fact, now I have two shields. But remember, a shield is Jesus Christ. Now listen, never allow yourself to be distracted by the devil. Always focus. Always focus on God. Trust Him at all times. When you spend time with God, it helps to lift your faith just like the soldiers lift their shields to block arrows. Good. Yes, I hope you understand. I hope you are having fun as well. I am having so much fun. Alright, now say this aloud with me. Say this with me. I am a boy on fire. Yes. I am a girl on fire. Mm. I am royalty. I belong to the best king. Anytime, any day, no matter what happens, I stand strong in God's image. Yes, I am not distracted by the 5Ds. Yes, I am not distracted. I have got the power. Nothing can stop me from being amazing like Jesus. Yes, nothing can stop you too. I have the full armor of God on at all times. Boys and girls on fire, keep lifting your faith. Keep quenching the fiery arrows of the devil. God can be trusted. You all rock big time.